Hi all folks, this is Max from Zetomax.com and HTCEvoHacks.com. So I've got the ROM review of the Salvage Mod Gingerbread ROM. This is uh, one of the best Android 2.3.5 ROMs out there. Uh, it's pretty much basic. Um, it comes with almost uh, nothing. Um, so it's a really great ROM for those of you looking for uh, a good AOSP ROM with the latest Android uh, 2.3.5. Um, it's very clean, everything's working out of the box. Um, I really like this because uh, I've been looking for a good 2.3.5 ROM. And uh, it's, it's a really nice ROM. Um, I was getting about, I mean the speeds aren't super you know fast or anything, but it's very clean ROM. Um, let me run impact real quick speeds are decent um, but uh, 29 Oops. sorry and uh, you can overclock it to 1.18 gigahertz um, you don't need a separate CPU app I just go to oh one thing I really like is the settings um, instead of you know you have to go through all these buttons you got about ROM apps parts um, you can go to performance CPU settings Maximum frequency, change that to there, set on boot. Um, oh, actually, you know what? I didn't set it overclock. Let me try that again. It should be a little bit faster. Um, I should probably get near 40 something if I keep running it. <clears throat> 36. Well, it's decent. Um, but if you're looking for a ROM to start out that's, you know, pretty much you know stripped down without any bloatware and you like the Android uh, AOSP this is built straight up from AOSP um, this is a really great ROM anyway uh, try it out let me know what you think um, make sure you you clear a daily cache after you install it um, and uh, I have links below and you also, you also have to uh, install Google Apps separately for this one um, but you can just flash it. Anyway, um, that was just a short overview of the salvage mod. Uh, that's the ROM of the week uh, at HTC Evo Hacks for the Evo 4G. Anyway, leave your comments. Uh, and uh, I'm just thinking about getting this Droid Bionic, uh, which launched today. So I, I'm going to go get it. I'm, it's going to be hell expensive. I don't want to pay $2.99 and then additional like 50 bucks on my family plan. But uh, I don't have an LG LTE phone, so you know I can't do test with the go head on head on head with uh, Sprint's 4G, and I also really need an LTE phone, so I think I'm gonna get it um, because I think the Droid Bionic is probably gonna be flagship for Verizon for the next like six months because they're not getting the Galaxy S2. Anyway, um, don't forget to subscribe and also check out my friend channels. Um, I'll have links right here. Uh, for apps, you can check out this guy here, and for more 3D Evo stuff here. Um, and thanks, y'all, and don't forget to subscribe. See y'all later.